We begin this hour 18 with breaking news. Another senseless drive by shooting on the city's west side. This time, a mother and her young son both caught in the crossfire, both shot. CBS 2's Marissa Parra is live at Central and Lake. Marissa, do police have any video to help them find these shooters? They do. In fact, Brad and Erica, as we've been walking past, I can see some cameras outside some of these businesses here, and police say they are combing through that video, and they say they'll actually be releasing some of that for us shortly here. But here's what we do know. It all started around 1 p.m. right over there on North Central Avenue. You can see that's actually a pretty busy street there. This video that you're looking at was taken earlier, right after that shooting. You can see people watching as police gather evidence over there. So far, we know that a dark-colored vehicle pulled up on the corner as a mother and her nine-year-old son stood nearby and got caught in the crossfire. This was a targeted incident where a, a group of people in a car got out, drove actually past the young men on the corner, shot at this group, and then fled. But there were several innocent bystanders uh, nearby uh, that were affected by this. A targeted incident, but the 27-year-old woman and her son were not the targets. Both of them hit by bullets in their lower back. Now, police don't know yet why the men started shooting at the group, but they are pleading with anyone who saw anything or knows anything to submit an anonymous tip. Now, of course, we can't forget the context. It feels like almost every week or every other week this summer, we're telling you a story of another child shot in Chicago. Just this past Sunday, a 14-year-old shot in Homan Square. And then on Monday, a 9-year-old shot in China. Him. And now we have a nine-year-old and his mother recovering in critical condition, rather, at Stroger Hospital. Reporting from South Austin, I'm Marissa Parra with CBS 2 News. Erica. Thank you, Marissa.